so we arrived in the airport in Pereira then we did like a one hour driving so we are so excited because we are right here in Santa Rosa de Cabal this is an amazing hot spring uh, we call it in Spanish termales so we are ready to have a lot of fun and we're gonna show you the view Something that I realized, guys, is a tip for all of you. In the end runs, they're going to ask you if you want to include the food. I highly recommend you don't include it because then you're gonna have more options. And actually, better prices or better options depends on what you're looking for. So enjoy. So, guys, another thing that is very famous here uh, in the coffee area, Medellin, around, is the chorizo con arepa. So, if you come here, ask for this. It's so good. It's called Chorizo Santa Rosa, eh, Santa Fereño. It's really, really good. So, cheers. <laughs> Today guys, we are in San Lento, Quindío. We are so happy because as you can see, uh, it's very important that you can visit the coffee farms. So you can see right here in the picture, right? Have you ever seen the movie Disney, Encanto? Yeah, this was one of the locations that was inspired and this is a must to do, right? You need to visit the coffee farms. This is a very beautiful place. It's called El Ocaso. That if you translate it, it's called uh, the sunset, right? And it's a beautiful, beautiful landscape. You can see you can have a special artisanal coffee right there. You can actually go to do this whole thing. They do tours in Spanish, in English. Uh, so let's do, come on in, let's do enjoy. And I just love this beautiful coffee farm right here in Salento, Kindi. So to work with this, we have to cut the top in order to get a job in an easy way. Second problem is not that resistant as Castillo is on the third one, it doesn't produce that much. But quality in top is such a great. So that's why in this farm we decided to make a special blend. 50% Tavi, 50% Castillo in order to have the perfect balance between quantity and quality. And we create our Salento coffee. When coffee is totally dry, it looks like peanuts. You see? When your fingers, please actually take one. So I want to teach you how to do it. So to add water, we have kind of science. So to add water, we're going to make first something that we call a pre-infusion. So we're going to add water in the middle and then surround, making circles with your hand, just until you cover surface, in a slow way. When you cover surface, you stop it. Okay, go ahead. Middle, yeah, and then surround. This is the gases that it owns in the frozen roast. So we have to wait between 20 to 50 seconds. <laughs>
excited. I'm trying to hold my breath because this is breath taken, guys. We are right here in, I'm not sure about the, the pronunciation, I should know. Valle del Cocora, Cocora. Ah, it's so beautiful. You can see the tallest palm trees, guys, in the world. Very close to Salento. And you can see right there, the beautiful mountains, right? You can barely see how tall they are, but this is like just amazing and beautiful. Spanish gondola, but in English, same word. Okay, so you can see this is the way that you transfer, it's like a cable bus. We just call it gondola in Spanish, and you can see we are ready to have a lot of fun. It's an amusement park, and of course, if you are in the coffee area, the topic of this park is actually coffee. So, have fun, and let's just see what is the next adventure. It's coming.